Hello, I'm Ron Clark. Today we're going to do a quadrangular gate. Uh, that's four paths and four sephirot. This is gate number 49. There are 56 quadrangles in total. Um, this quadrangle is interesting. It uh, encompasses uh, Gebura to Yesod to Gejula to Tiferet and back to Gebura and then back around. That's the direction of the gate. Um, it dances around. It encompasses the Aleph Resh crossing, the center point of the Tree of Life. So this gate always has something to say about balance um, and equilibrium. So, uh, let's go ahead and get started here. Um, okay, I should talk about what this gate consists of first. Uh, we start in Gebura. We follow the path of Nun to um, Yesod. Nun is Scorpio, uh, the fish. Um, and then we take the path of Lamed up to uh, Gedjula. Uh, Lamed is Libra, uh, the ox goat or the, the snake unfurled, um, uncoiled. Uh, then we go via the path of uh, Leo, of the path of Teth, um, the snake coiled or basket. Then we go from Tiferet back down to Gebura along the path of Yod, uh, which is the finger, the pointing finger, uh, Virgo. Um, so that is the, the pattern of this gate. Um, so I'll start as usual um, by bringing in the Catholic brilliance and energizing each of these Sephiroth. We have Gebura. We have Yesod. We have Gejula. And we have Tiferet. So all four are energized and the gate is energized. Um, and interestingly enough, when I energize this gate, the, the paths that are really highlighted energetically are the paths of the gate that we are following, and Aleph and Resh. They just automatically um, light up. Okay. So, off we go. I'm transferring my awareness to give you a... Redness of energy is all around me, of power, of my power, distinctly me here in Gebura. Whole world bows to my will in Gebura. I am the center of control here in Gebura. And I radiate my power all around me, doing my will here in Gebura. And I look down to Yesod. Oh, Yesod. I look down and I see that it's about other as well. It's not just about me but about me in relation to other, so I travel down this path towards other. And I'm creating this realm as I pass. I am creating this realm of interaction where I interact with other. Oh, it's all about interacting with other. Oh, always with other, there's me and there's other, 
and the differences between us and similarities, they're all so significant. Ah, that's the heart of significance. Me and other, other and me, constantly communicating back and forth, constantly blending our energies here in Yesod, the beautiful realm of Yesod, the garden of earthly delights, Yesod. Ah, Yesod. And I look up to Gajula. Oh, and I feel such connection with other. Other is self, is, we are all so connected. Oh, and here in Gajula, that connection with other is so close, so close with other. But it's all so regimented. Hmm. We are all fit together in a grand puzzle. Me and other and other and other and other and other and other and other. Ad infinitum. We are all here together. Oh, yes. Together. Places. My Gebura in context. In sequence. They all fit. Great radiant star in my universe. I differ at my radiant light of I here, but it's I, me, mine only, my solitary I. But I'm in a universe full of eyes, full of radiant suns, all working together to form this universe. So beautiful, so radiant, so alive. We are that life that radiates throughout the universe. Oh, yeah. Radiating all of us together. Me, my solitary self, all the other solitary selves. They are other, but not other. We are so alike, and I see all these other solitary selves that I have associated with for eons. My family, oh, my family, oh, I embrace my family. We are all here together, working together. And I look down to Gebura, <laughs> my power, power of my individual self made manifest and solid here in Gebura. Oh, this power that I have, this gift that I give to the universe keeps it running, keeps it moving in the proper way. My gift that I give freely and wholly and unreservedly I give it in service to the whole. Oh, my power, my gift is only powerful when it is given. It is my gift. Oh, and I return up to Tiferet with my power as an offering to the whole of us here in Tiferet, weaving ourselves into existence into the existence so far below the world of things and people. Oh, and I pass down 
moment gives you the oh where we are all so connected and get you the mm, sweet feeling of connection. Oh, oh it makes my power so worthwhile. All oh, these connections with my family. We stand right next to each other. Oh, wow. And I pass my light down into Yesod. And I light up the world. We dance. sacred gift I give freely and with love to my family and to all the rest all my cousins my nieces my nephews all The quadrangular gates are definitely more complex than the triangular gates. More involved, more levels of self involved. Here we have the solitary self and the sentient self. Mercy and severity. It's, it's the alafresh point of balance here. Um, uh, but integrating all of those parts together. So they're not separate. They all express uh, the others in a way. So that's a quadrangular gate. <laughs> Next week is going to be a uh, pentangular gate with five sephirot and five paths. Um, which is a different sort of beast entirely. So, I will see you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>